This is the top drawer of my standing desk. This is the cheap way to make a standing desk. I got the sets of uh, drawers for $32 at Big W. I got two sets and I made a standing desk out of it. Now the top right hand side I've dedicated to three ladies, all of them editors. The first one is Esme, the second one is Vicky, and the third one is Cherie. And I keep their printed works in that top drawer, top right hand drawer. Anyway, I'm, I'm dedicating this video to Esme because I made her a Christmas present. She just lives down the street and um, I thought I'd show you some of my work at the same time. This was the first star picture I did. Pity it's got glass, eh? Twenty fifteen, and I'm still doing star pictures. It's a very good theme to have. But this was the very first one I did, and I thought I could do more of those. I've done quite a few now. I like to experiment with colour. Comes from being studying physics for eight years. Light and energy. Let's see if this all blows out. This is amazing, this one. This is a 3D print that I did. Don't ask me who did it. I didn't. I just coloured it in. But I will reference it when I find references. That's from The Witcher. A series of books that was turned into a video game and a TV series. A Polish bloke, Andrew Wasserwitz or something, he made a mistake. When the games people approached him, they asked him whether he wanted royalties or a lump sum, and he, he said he wanted a lump sum. Ah, if he'd have taken royalties, he'd have got a lot more money. Anyway, this is a pyramid that I made, printed from. Uh, Something that I found on either Thingiverse or um, Cults online. You can download the, they're like a blueprint file and then you, you have to modify them so that they'll work with your printer. And here is Esme's Christmas present. stuck on a rock you see she got me rock painting it's a painted pyramid you put your brushes in there and um, you can also use it as a stand to support your artwork if you've got four of them you can put them on each corner of the artwork so that it gets it off your desk and, you, and you, you've got room to paint underneath room not to paint underneath these are amiibos these things you put them on the joystick and things happen in the game, you get free gifts. They cost you for the Amiibos, of course. And I've got about uh, 16 Zelda ones and two, four, five, that's 21 I've got so far, and I just ordered another two. I called this one Dark Energy. On the other side, I've got the universes. I might, I might save that one for uh, one of the other ladies when I do another talk. Oh, and before I finish, I'd like you to do one thing when you're watching my videos. If you carry out a tally, you put a vertical line if you, if you hear something that you haven't heard before. And when you get four vertical lines, you put a horizontal line through. That, ca that makes five. That's called tally marking. Now, if you do tallies as, you walk, as you're watching my video, I'd like you to uh, comment and tell me how many tally marks you came up with, how many things you didn't know that you found out while you were watching my video. Thank you very much and have a very good Christmas to everybody. 
And a happy New Year, that's the main thing, it's the Happy New Year we want. Not a bad New Year like this one. Bye bye.